Today, the people of free, democratic Mexico come together to welcome the 35th president of the United States. To welcome their neighbor, John F. Kennedy. Mexico City, Plaza Mayor de la Constitución, where today the sounds of history in the making echo and re-echo with the sounds of Mexico's... Many there were at arm's reach who could have done him harm, but he seemed to fear no evil from people. He radiated a hope, a promise, a strength fulfilled. He clasped their hands in friendship. He felt no peril. universities are regarded as dangerous places for presidents, and we are grateful to you for your warm welcome to all of us on this occasion. Every one of us will go home with a most profound impression of what a strong, vital people can accomplish. And I think that this journey, that this journey to Costa Rica has illuminated the minds of 180 million people of what a great opportunity and privilege we have to be associated together in our common cause. Viva Costa Rica, Arriba Costa Rica, mucho gracias. six presidents of the Isthmus reaffirmed the idea and the Declaration of Central America. President Orlick of Costa Rica said it in another way. A new generation is arising here. 
They are the men of Latin America, convinced that the revolution has not been wasted, but has only begun. Thank <laughs> you.